Box. Hey, I'm hungry. Why don't we just eat Mr. Pigeon? He's a really minor character, and this is the last episode. Mm, forget it. I think he already suspects something. I'll get that. Oh. It might be a charity-minded neighbor bringing pizzas and hamburgers. Huh? Hi there. I've come to ask about the room you have for rent. <laughs> hey, what an authentically disgusting dump. It'll be a source of inspiration. <laughs> so what exactly do you do? I'm a musician. <laughs> ah, okay. So you earn obscene amounts of money, which you'll be happy to hand over in rent, right? No. I can't stand that commercial bullshit. <laughs> right now, I'm composing an opera about a guy dressed in a chicken suit. <laughs> I am Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. <laughs> Listen, dude, what's this Mozart guy on? He spends his whole time knocking back brewskis and playing sonatas. Yep, and I think he ate Mr. Pigeon because it's days since I last saw him. Hmm? <laughs> See you, ladies. <laughs> Hey, dude, what were you doing in there? That was one of my world-famous Viennese quartets! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell are you doing? I like living on the edge. <laughs> That's what us musicians are like. Just look at Beethoven. My personal motto is sex, drugs, and symphonies in D major. <laughs> hey, is that stuff you got there what I think it is? It's snuff. <laughs> Snort a couple of lines of this shit and you'll be sneezing all night long. My dealer ships it in from Salzburg. Ha <laughs> ha! You want some? Count me out. That stuff there destroys your brain cells. I'll have a line. I've always wanted a real good sneeze. <laughs> it was you who ate Mr. Pigeon, you liar! Security! Security! Figara! No. Figare! No. Figaro! Figaro! I like it! <laughs> Listen, this is totally unacceptable. We can't get to sleep! Not even watching the English patient! Stop it now and go to bed, please! What are you talking about? The band's just coming around to run through a couple of numbers! <laughs> now? At 3 o'clock in the morning? Hey! Hello! What's up? What the hell's going on? Okay! Is everybody ready? <laughs> One, two, a one, two, three, four. Ah! What is this infernal cacophony? Uh, 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 I can't take it anymore. We've got to do something. I think I have an idea. Um, hey, excuse me, excuse me. Look, I'm tripping out on this thing you got going on with the violins and all that stuff, but uh, you know what I think would be really cool now? A sneezing session! Yeah! Let's get sneezy! Let's get sneezy! I always wanted a really good sneeze. Yeah! An invigorating sneeze and a bevy of prostitutes! Uh, wait a minute! I'm sorry. I'm all out of snuff. <laughs> no problem. I have. I have a large package I smuggled here in the chassis of a carriage. So where do you keep this merchandise? <laughs> right behind that door. <gasps> oh, 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 I don't understand why we can't find a roommate who'll stay longer than a week. By the way, I got a call from Megan Fox. She's interested in renting a room where she can do her aerobics in the nude. What? And what did you tell her? Well, I said it depends whether they decide to commission a second season of the series. Will it be continued?